Good afternoon, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. This is Rich again, back for your second video blog of the day for Friday, June 19th, 2015, around 4.31 in the afternoon in Berwick, Massachusetts. It's about 4.31 in the afternoon. It's sunny out, but a little bit humid, and can't complain about that because this week's been on and off cloudiness dampness you name it and better take what looks coming because it's gonna rain soon again some news to report premier boxing has announced it's buying airtime on fox sports one this year premier boxing has been buying airtime on nbc nbcsn um CBS, Showtime, ESPN, now it's buying time on Fox Sports 1. Next thing you know, they'll probably be buying time on Fox Sports and probably maybe TNT and TBS. Every, every, every like, thing that airs sports. And it's happening National Flip Flops Day. And that's about it on the news. My second video blog subject of, today, of the day is about my memories of the junior prom of my junior prom that happened on April 29th 1994 and I remember my junior prom like it was yesterday I, I the my junior prom was held at the Westford Regency Inn and Hotel in Westford Massachusetts it's on route Route 110, it's off of exit 32 on Route 495. And I went to my junior prom. My date was a girl named Leanne Moscone. And I asked her to the prom in about January of 1994, and she accepted it. And she got, and we went to the to prom at the Westford Regency Inn and Hotel. Um, before the prom, I actually, a month before, at an auction for the positive place for kids, the Boys and Girls Club of Greater Valleca, I somebody bid it for me, and they won me a prom package, which had all kinds of good stuff for it, and, and, a, and included a tuxedo rental and a free one-hour ride in a limo. And to this day, I do not know who who won that prize prom package for me. There's a few people I, kn I think I know who it, who it is, but they never came forward and that. It's probably going to remain a secret to this to, for the rest of my life, but uh, who, know, who knows. Anyway, I remember that day quite well on April 20, 29, 1994, because in school, that day was they. It was there was a big fire drill, which actually turned out to be a little, small electrical fire, in uh, in the in the hallway of the new building built by like Memorial High School. And I also remember that day in school as well because they were having like kind of a going away party for for a student teacher in my U.S. history class with Mrs. Robich. That's that student teacher was Mr. Tom Murphy, who is now the principal of Bellwick Memorial High School. Interesting fact, isn't it? So anyway, I remember I didn't get dismissed or anything. I went home and I just like changed, put on my tuxedo first time. I was in a tuxedo first of three times. And then afterwards, my I went over to Leanne's house and that's where the limo picked us up and stuff like that. And then going to the limo she wore like a nice dress and stuff like that and I looked very good in a tuxedo I didn't wear any of my hats and stuff like that and we we went on a limousine and before going to the to, to the Westford Regency Inn and Hotel we stopped by the Boys and Girls Club Greater Valleca because that's where I'm, I was a member at and that's how, how I met Leanne well her sister Janelle told um, Moscone actually worked at the Positive Place for Kids, the Boys and Girls Club, Great Bell Echo for many years and stuff. That's how I met Leanne through the net now. And before before going to the prom, we went outside and everybody was, all the staff members and all the members were taking pictures of that. Uh, it's pretty cool and stuff like that. And I remember it was like a, like the limo going down the Boys and Girls 
built up area on Campbell Road, 19 Campbell Road. They had it was like, I think a couple of people before the limo and after the limo was just like a thing that like a motorcade for a presidential, <laughs> presidential thing and stuff like that. But I wasn't the president. So anyway, the limo goes, goes out of the club right on to Route 3, then on to Route 495, then gets gets off uh, uh, off like exit 32, and then we're at the Westford Regency Hotel. I think me and Leanne were the first um, people who there at the, at the like prom waiting to get in because it was 7.30, took pictures and stuff like that, and then, and then everybody else came in and stuff like that, and all, all of like the class officers were there, and Mr. McClellan was there, who was the principal the vice principal for the class of 1995, the advisors, Miss Johansson and Mrs. Connors with their husbands and stuff. Mr. McClellan brought his wife as well. Mr. McClellan was a, lived in Westford. And also they had a couple of teachers as chaperones. I think Mr. Leduca was a science teacher with his wife and Mr. Mr. Doherty, a math teacher with his girlfriend. And there was a science teacher, Mr. Jeb Eslin, and he brought his wife with him as a chaperone, like they were chaperones, and I think Mrs. Capadano and her husband, and Mrs. Aidy and her husband, and, <laughs> and stuff like that, and it was a fun time there and stuff, there was a lot of songs there, lots of like dancing and stuff, they played what, what you see, what was typical at proms in the 1990s, like YMCA and the Electric Slide and Funky Town and, and Gun Criss Cross Jump Jump and House of Pain and stuff. And, uh, and I also slow dance with Leanne. It was pretty good and stuff like that. The, the theme song for the 1994 Junior Prom was Heaven and stuff like that. And then they had like the dancing for the, like the, Prom Queen and stuff, and it was a song, Wonderful Tonight, by Eric Idle and stuff, which was pretty good. Actually, Wonderful Tonight was the theme for the, for, for the prom for 1995, which I went to for my senior prom and stuff, which was pretty good. And then they had, like, the like the queen of the prom, and they announced the finalist. Like, the finalist included, like, Lolly Zawatsky and, and Kel Kelly Silva and... Karen Fahey and Nicole Horgan and the prom queen was I think um, Kelly Domenis and stuff and was f pretty fun and stuff like that and you know had a great time and stuff they actually videotaped my prom they had a VHS tape and stuff and they had so many co cool things there they like taped the entire prom but they like edited it down and stuff and had like show, showing sometimes fast dances and slow dances and stuff like that, but they got a little too close to like the dance floor and stuff like that. And some of the pe the people at the pump say get out of here and stuff, and they were looking at the camera like a, like a disgusted look sometimes and stuff like that. But hey, it was it was fun and stuff like that. And I actually was. I actually was interviewed for the prom and stuff like that and I said my name and I wish everybody had a good time at the prom and they go out and have a safe time don't want anybody people dying or drinking and driving and because I care for them that much and stuff like that and it was a pretty good video actually I accidentally like ran in front of Mrs. Johansson by mistake because I was spotting somebody and stuff and it was pretty funny on the video and stuff which that was on VHS but a couple of weeks ago somebody put that 1995 junior prom on YouTube which is pretty good and stuff like that and, and it was real real fun having a great time with Leanne and stuff and it was it's one of my most memorable moments and that's about it on that I'll be back for the third and final video blog of the night which will be about former Major League Baseball pitcher Oro Hershiser and like I always say to everybody, keep calm, and I'm a Julie Broughton guy. Have a good day, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter.